Today's question is. What is the chameleon effect in borderline personality disorder? One of the biggest and most challenging aspects of borderline personality disorder, BPD, is often the chameleon effect or mirroring. This is the constant unconscious change in the person's self as they struggle to fit in with their environment or the people around them. It is, essentially, a fluctuating identity and is often seen as multiple personalities when in fact there is only one that is the chosen one at that present time. This is not to be confused with a split personality that you so often see with a patent with dissociative identity disorder. Did, previously known as multiple personality disorder, MPD, people will often change their personality style, especially with the promise of New Year's resolutions like start, stop, change, start dieting, stop smoking and even changing jobs. For someone with borderline personality disorder, BPD, change is less consciously determined. Transformation for such a person is more reflexive, less rehearsed. The borderline chameleon changes depending on the environment and who is present, constantly struggling to fit in. A Republican among Republicans, a Democrat among Democrats, the borderline lacks a stable, consistent collection of beliefs and principles. This fluctuating identity makes it difficult to establish a firm sense of self. Just as someone with BPD struggles to stabilize a coherent, reliable identity, the clinician contends with establishing a diagnosis that may be just as elusive. The chameleon-like disguises of BPD implicate various illnesses. Could mood swings suggest major depression or bipolar disorder? Does destructive impulsivity infer attention deficit disorder or cover over drug abuse? Maybe their series of impaired relationships implies anxiety disorder or post-traumatic stress? What about feelings of paranoia or unreality? Is it schizophrenia? Am I borderline? Or is it just that sometimes I act crazy? BPD is so difficult to accurately diagnose because it intersects with other disorders in several ways. Most often, it may coexist, but be submerged, in the wake of a more prominent disorder, such as depression. Borderline symptoms may not become discernible until after treatment of the other illness is mobilized. Secondly, BPD's chameleon disguise may mimic another syndrome and induce an incorrect assessment. In such a way, a cursory evaluation of mood swings may initiate a misapplied label of bipolar disorder. Alternatively, BPD may camouflage another illness and be installed inaccurately as the primary diagnosis. Just as the borderline individual is a chameleon, constantly altering identity, so is the BPD diagnosis. Differentiating the syndrome from other maladies can be almost as challenging a task as the struggle to conquer the illness and some people will even mimic people of normal behavior making it look like they are cured when yet again it is another symptom of BPD. Can you relate to these shape-shifting and chameleon-like behaviors? If you do why not leave a comment so we can all help each other out. If you or someone you know is exhibiting symptoms of BPD, do visit our website at bpd.org.uk for even more help and advice. In the meanwhile, please do subscribe to this channel as well as turn on notifications for even more BPD content.